Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Galaxy Opal, Julius Randall. Randall definitely deserves a moments card. He had 57 last night. They did lose to the Timberwolves, and Torian Prince had an amazing game as well for the Timberwolves. Also got a moments card that I'll be doing gameplay on later. But Julius Randall had one of the best games of his career last night. He had he was like 19 to 29 from the field, made eight threes, 57 points. Just an amazing performance for Julius Randall. Unfortunately, in a loss for the Knicks, but. Still going to be, I'm still excited to use this card and see how good he is. And I'm glad to see more moments cards this week. We've gotten three moments cards in the last two days after not getting moments cards really for a while, which is definitely nice to see. want to see more of them, and I definitely am pleased by that. But before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 11,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every single day. I would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. See what Mr. Julius Randall is looking like. So he's 6'8 at power forward. I almost wish he could play small forward. I know he doesn't play small forward at all in real life, but it would be nice to make him a little more usable i feel like um but 99 offense 98 defense 95 driving layup 97 close shot 89 midi 94 three ball 90 driving dunk 80 standing dunk 86 ball handle 80 block 90 interior 84 steel 88 perimeter makes him a decent but not insane defender pretty good rebounder 90 speed and excel and an 87 lateral quickness so statistically he's very solid all the way around 16 hops include badges like acrobat bully fast twitch fearless finisher limitless takeoff masher post riser slithery corner specialist volume shooter clamp breaker quick first step post lockdown box up east rebound chaser and brick wall also has gold aerial wizard a bunch of other gold badges include badges like drop stepper rise up agent three blinders catch and shoot dead eye limitless range bailout break starter handles for days hyper drive unpluckable anchor challenger clamps glove interceptor pogo stick workhorse badges to add on him probably like shooting badges like guard up and slippery off wall would be good ankle braces pick dodger that's about it i mean he's very very complete even as a base card really doesn't need much added which is definitely nice to see and a lot of cards are coming like that at this point which i think is a huge w not really having to spend as much on badges to make cards look good at this point in the year now player build for julius randall i mean he's T max size like which means he's the size of a two to be completely honest now release is on very quick which makes it better but it is still not a great release i will say uh, i don't think julius randall's release himself is all that great but honestly i'm not that concerned about this type of thing especially for a moments card i just want to see more moments cards because it gives players who i mean like knicks fans in real life they're huge fans of julius randall a lot of them especially with how he's been playing recently so they want to use a julius randall card in my team he doesn't have to be the best card in the game he just has to be solid and that's what this card looks like he's gonna be solid he's got normal fade a decent enough jumper he's gonna be a very very solid slasher, really capable shooter, uh, decent defender. He's a little undersized and he's not going to be the best power forward in the world. He's going to struggle against Kareem and KP and Yao and Taco and guys like that and KG. I mean, whatever. He's going to struggle against the best cards in the game, but that's okay. He's a fun card to use and I think that's a huge W to see more and more of these types of moments cards in my team. So props to my team for dropping a lot of moments cards the last couple days. Hoping to see that continue and honestly carry over more into next year. But overall, I mean, he looks like a pretty decent card. He moves pretty well. His sigs look all right. He's got a decent enough release gonna be a good slasher solid defender all that stuff let's hop into a game and see what julius randall can do all right our opponent um <laughs> i'm playing my boy dex this is one of my buddies on twitter uh he's a sweat he's got a sweaty team as y'all can see we got david robinson versus julius randall in this clutch time game that's funny uh shout out to my boy dex one of my homies uh great dude he actually edits for splash as well on youtube if y'all know splash my boy as well uh but this should be a fun little matchup right here he's gonna try to cook with t-mac i'm just gonna try to cook with julius randall good offensive rebound by d robin he puts it in to start off the game we might wind up losing this game uh i use a tease he's a good player but uh this is not the easiest matchup in the world but julius randall's gonna go to work we're gonna get to one with julius randall dragging back four three he's not stepping up and i can't shoot i suck i don't want to talk about it i don't want to talk about it that's bad that is a bad miss by me i don't know why i can't shoot sometimes but good defense good d up play the slip x switch it good good straight up yes good d beautiful he can't green there oh damn it he greened it i wasn't thinking that i wasn't thinking he was gonna get that off but he did hey good shot by him and uh, let's see what we can do hitting our pop to mr julius randall stopping and going julius all the way to the rim hey quick drop me yes sir i don't know if he has actual quick drops but it looks like he has good safe dunks so that's a really good one anyway right there and julius does get to the rim for his first points in the game should have five points right now but i can't shoot so he doesn't oh good board now yes look at julius skying up for the rebound over d rob d rob might have him in height by like four inches but it doesn't matter because julius has the grit man he's going to get to work hit it out to yao catch and shoot good pass and i can't shoot yeah Yo, what is going on? My thumbs aren't working today. It's my second wide open three I've missed. Like, what's going on with me right now? Uh, we got to hit, hit our shots, but good D. X switch. Chill. Good move. Oh, my. Good move. I just sold that badly. We got lucky to get the board at all. Uh, normal fade with Scotty Barnes out the corner. That's, that's open? Hey, good shot. 
uh, well, not my best start. We've, we should have eight points as well, but I can have missed two wide open threes. So that's pretty, pretty great, right? Uh, but pinch attack in here, hitting it out to Julius Randle on the catch and shoot again. He's going to fade for me instead. And I still can't green. Goodness gracious. I didn't expect the fade timing, but I mean, I, I saw it in time. I should have been able to adjust to it. And I just cannot shoot right now. This is, this is not a good look. Uh, good defense though. We're good. Come on, T-Mac. Get through the screen. Get through the screen, T-Mac. Good defense. That's a tough shot. If he hits that, he hits it. We'll live. Julius with the second board, though. We're just going to throw the leak out. Uh, we'll take the dunk. That was honestly a pretty risky pass could have easily been a steal in of itself but we'll take it um but yeah we gotta get we gotta get things going man i've missed a bunch of open shots already that's like three in this game we just got to do better good defense though that's not a good sh yo see i can't green an open shot and he can't miss tough shots that's the second like really tough shot he's hit this game ah props to you my boy that's that's a great shot hit our pop again julius catch and shoot we're gonna green this one please yes finally i'm hitting shots finally there we go knocking that one down again we should have like nine more points on this game we've missed three wide open threes but we're gonna we're gonna hit him eventually right uh good defense get back out there julius i need you to play some defense for me i need you to work against d rob in the post good d yes sir we get a stop we're pushing in transition again getting our pick and pop going yet again attack here julius hit it to him spin move hey pump fake back out to t mac oh we're gonna get three seconds run to the rim good normal fade can i green mine yes sir good normal fade from the midi with t mac able to get ourselves a bucket at the end of the possession and we're only down one with two minutes left what can we do here get through the screen get through the screen good watch the pop that's a tough shot if he greens it he greens it yep we're gonna make him shoot lightly with Yao. that is a shot that i am willing to give up to be completely honest uh sizing up here escape drag back yes sir good move to do julius I tried to walk back and I messed it up. We're going to get a normal fade though. Julius, I need to hit this. Oh my gosh, I cannot shoot. I don't know where I lost the ability to shoot, man, but it's not good. It is not good. We got to do better. Plain and simple. Good defense, Luke Walton. Good D. Yo, he is sliding and I just got popped, but he finally misses a shot. We'll take that. I can't shoot, man. I've missed four open shots this game. It's, it's bad. This is not looking good. Attacking the rim. Good. Pa I was going to pass that down to Yao. Try to... Uh, Try to throw the bail out, but we're going to get free throws instead because he went up and got fouled. Free throw release is pretty good. It's pretty smooth, not too slow. Definitely looks pretty solid. I think it's like his own free throw or something because I don't think I've seen this free throw much. But of course, I missed the second one because I suck. But it's all right. T-Mac, go play some D. He's going to try to crab me. Good. Get back up. We'll play the slip. Go. Oh, that's a tough shot. If he hits that normal fade, that's a tougher one. That's a pretty tough one. So we'll live with it. Stopping on the break. Julius Randle, 4 3. We're pulling up in transition. Green at a 12%. That's the type of shot I want to see out of you, Julius. Let's go. And he's got take. He's got sharp take. So we're going to try to take advantage of that on the next possession. Good D up. He's forcing now. Good D. Beautiful. Yeah, with another board. Julius has 9 2 and 2. He's kind of filling up the stat sheet right now. I'm seeing, I'm seeing it, Julius. You're doing your thing, baby. Drag back. Chill stop on the stop pull up that's too deep ah that's i mean that might not be too deep but that's a tough shot that's a really tough shot deep at least been dribbling a lot we'll live with it though i'm okay with it i think we could agree in that one but it's not a bad shot by any means uh oh, i'm gonna get standing dunked that's my fault didn't cut him off well enough with Yao. 32 seconds left though a bucket here from julius would be absolutely huge i'm gonna go pick and roll instead of pick and pop here because he's expecting the pop well he's gonna give the pop up anyway so we're gonna shoot it anyway he's fading from narnia just set your feet julius that's 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 a wide open catch and shoot three if he'll just set his feet i mean it is like oh my that's so tough bro good d and good if he greens that he's he's a dog i'm not gonna lie get a board oh get the board five four three two one i jumped oh no oh my hmm well I jumped too early with you out. That's my fault. We lose that game. If I just hit my open shots, we win. Three of eight, two of seven from three. A couple of them were tough shots, but several of them I should have grained. But I'm still pretty impressed by this Julius Randall card. Let's hop back to the main menu and let's review the card. Honestly, I enjoyed that game. That was kind of fun to play. Even though we did lose, I, I just got to hit more shots. I don't know why he was fading from Narnia at one point off the pop and stuff, trying to fade and all that, but... It is what it is. I, I think this card's pretty good. I don't think he's like next level elite, but he can definitely compete. The power forward position, he can he can hold his own. He's just going to struggle against the really, really big power forwards because he is undersized. But he's a fun card to use. Knicks fans are going to like him, and he's definitely usable in my team, which is something that I like to see. So hopefully y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate y'all. Peace.